Thomas, this must be Hi. quite nice for you. You get to come here to Old Trafford and put your feet up. Yes, I put my feet up. No, no one puts his feet up in Old Trafford. It's one of the biggest stages in world football. It's a very special atmosphere and I'm, I'm happy to have the privilege to be at the sideline of a Champions League match at Old Trafford. So um, uh, on these kind of occasions, you need to bring uh, the best out of yourself and out of our team is, uh, is normal. Nothing else matters. Is it nice, though, to be able to come here without too much pressure on you? You've already qualified top of this group yeah. in what's been a really tough group, actually, very competitive. Very competitive group, very tough matches, very tight matches. And we came out with four from four, four victories from four matches and then a draw. So we have 13 points and could already yeah, secure first place very early, which is uh, very nice to, to play to play these kind of matches now without the pressure that you absolutely have to get a result. Mm. But at the same time, uh, there's always pressure on from ourselves. There's demands from ourselves. When we come here, when we put the shirt on, when you play on these kind of stages, you, 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 you play for the result, but, but uh, for us to, to keep it going. And I imagine you want to keep the unbeaten run in the group stage going. 39 yes. games is quite incredible for the club and yeah. you don't want to be the manager to yeah, lose we that, just, do you? Yeah, I, I don't want to be that manager and we just lost our, um, our, our record in the Bundesliga. We had our first defeat and um, quite a big one and uh, uh, it was not... Uh, it was not so well explainable why that happened so even after a defeat that we had now we, we want to have a reaction because this is what it's all about um, to show a reaction after a loss and, and uh, we want to take this opportunity straight tomorrow. Well that defeat to Frankfurt was, was a shock to everyone you just said you, you yeah. don't know you can't really explain what happened. Well we can explain days, what, it what? We, we can explain it we had uh, as we, we saw from our data that we had 22 uh, critical ball losses which is a ridiculous number given the fact that 10 is already high so you should have like top teams like we want to be should have like uh, uh, a low a low number below 10 uh, we had 22 which is by itself a ridiculous high number of of, of critical ball losses and the reaction after the ball losses was not on any of our level and of our standards. Uh, we could have defended uh, every single of the first four goals. We did big mistakes, but we were never in a minority. We always had the superiority in defending. We could not block shots. We could not win defensive duels. The reaction to help each other out after the mistakes was uh, far off our level and we have to come back very soon. How do you work on all of those things then in such a short space of Addressing time? Addressing it very directly in this, uh, you, always, you always react differently because the situation is always different. But having a period of, of nine days to prepare a match because uh, we, we had one game delayed because of the snow or suspended. So that is absolutely not satisfying and this is uh, below my, my, my expectation towards myself and it's below all of our fans expectations and all what, what Bayern Munich is all about. This is, uh, was very hard still to swallow and to accept and in, in this case especially we, we directed it very very straightforward to the team on, on the day after to also, yeah, to, to also have it out of the system so we were very critical with ourselves. We pointed it out uh, as it was, as we saw it. And OK, so this is uh, at the same time. OK, then at some point you need to get over it. And, and it's good that we have the chance today to train here and, and get our heads clear. Because it was the first league defeat of the season, yeah. will it be interesting for you to see how the players respond? Yeah, it will be interesting. We had. This was unfortunately not our first defeat. We had a defeat in the Super Cup final. We came back very strong after that. We had then a, a, also a very surprising defeat in the Cup against the third division team. Came back after in Dortmund very strong. So I, I, I trust my team and all of us that we can bounce back. The thing that we work, out, uh, work on is, is to be more stable within matches, between matches and on the special occasions to, to not crack under pressure. So tomorrow, um, as you say very, uh, very rightly, th this is uh, not the biggest pressure because we don't have to come up with a, with a result per se, but we have pressure from our previous loss in the Bundesliga and we, we have pressure anyway, always at Bayern Munich, which we normally embrace and 
So it's a good opportunity to step up. Because you have already qualified top of the group, there was some insinuation that maybe a first strongest team wouldn't be put out for this game. But because of that defeat at the weekend, does it give you more reason to field your strongest side? Yes, and and on the other side, if you play at Old Trafford, there is uh, there is a sense to a, to a very special football stage, and and there is a sense to a very special occasion. I I I can imagine that. I'm, I'm very sure that none of the players would would accept to just rest for the sake of resting or for 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 the for the situation in the in the table to to get a pause. The, these are the stages and these are the matches that you absolutely want to play. So we play with our very best team for this that we think uh, who deserve to start and who are the best fit. And then we hopefully end with a very strong team from the bench because influence from the bench is very important. So um, we don't. And anyway, we had a nine. We had a pause of nine days, so there is no need to rest anybody. Thank you, Thomas. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Thank you.